It's Friday, May 27th, 2016. Memorial Day weekend is here. Enjoy it however you choose to celebrate. Here's your two-minute video news source for all things Oregon Outback. It's The Flash. Lake County Commissioner Dan Shown was in Washington, D.C. last week representing the National Association of Counties. Shown participated in multiple meetings with politicians about the urgency of legislation to address ever-increasing wildfire severity. Shown met with the Wildland Fire Leadership Council, Oregon Rep. Greg Walden, had a meeting at the White House and addressed legislation to recognize biomass as renewable energy. A meeting at the Lakeview Library considered a community garden to be located behind Lake District Hospital. Coordinated as part of the Outback Food Initiative through Resource Assistance for Rural Environments, the hope is to establish a garden with around 15 available plots to be rented out to community members interested in shared garden space. Discussion ranged from pesticides to construction and what crops could be grown, with additional planning meetings coming soon. With spring sports finish, it's a time to celebrate the season's accomplishments. At Lakeview High School, awards banquets were held for golf and track and field this week, while Paisley School also held a track awards dessert social on Wednesday. Individual and team accolades were distributed and videos presented highlighting the season's success. LHS Golf qualified one athlete for state championships, Tate Lytle timed for fourth place, while Paisley and Lakeview track teams combined for seven total medals at last week's state track finals in Eugene. It's Memorial Day weekend and while many take advantage of sleeping in or barbecuing, for others it's a solemn time of remembrance with multiple ceremonies taking place across Lake County. Among the planned events will be a ceremony at Lake County Courthouse presented by Veterans of Foreign Wars with full military honors starting at 11 a.m. on Monday to recognize Lake County residents who died serving in American wars. Additionally, VFW members will be selling buddy poppies today and Saturday at multiple locations following a national tradition stretching back to 1922. And members will place flags at Lake County cemeteries. Well, there's the buzzer. So that does it for us this week. To keep up with everything happening around Lake County, check out our online calendar, follow us across these social media sites, catch a new Lake County Flash every Friday, and for these stories and so much more, be sure to pick up the next Lake County Examiner. If your child is between the ages of 12 and 21, then starting next month, they can participate in a new promotion through Lake Health District and the Community Health Improvement Program. That could win prizes ranging from iTunes gift certificates to a tablet just by getting a regular checkup. Starting on June 15th, bring your child to see the doctor for an adolescent welfare visit and they will be entered into a raffle drawing, guaranteed to win from an assortment of free prizes. This program is being offered because we don't want you to wait until you're sick to see the doctor. Regular doctor visits for children and adults help to prevent illness, keeping your family healthier and happier. It's just one of the ways that Lake Health District and CHIP are working together to ensure a better Lake County. Call Lake Health District today to schedule your appointment and win some free stuff while you're at it.